Hi, I'm Gary from the Statewide Vision Resource Centre. In this video, we'll be looking at the bookshelf on the new generation Victor Reader stream. So what we're going to do now is have a look at the bookshelf because that's the way that we navigate through the various options that you can access on the Victor Reader. So first of all, we're going to turn the Victor Reader on. So I'm locating the little round button on the top left hand corner on the side of the Victor Reader. I'm holding that in, listening for the beep. There it is. And it always takes a couple of seconds to go and check the data. Welcome to Victor Reader. Here we go. It should take us back to where we were last Charlie time. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. File 1. CCF01.mp3. Now, navigating your way around the various options. So, they have a bookshelf key. And I always think of it as it's a bit like having a bookshelf, a physical bookshelf in a way. By pressing the number one, it cycles you through the various options. So I'm gonna go up and press the number one key now. Top, it's on the keypad, found it. I'm pressing it once. Bookshelf, other books, one, book, one. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Okay, so basically it says other books. That means that these are MP3 books, basically. Other books always get put into this, into that particular folder. So that's the first one. Now I'm pressing one again, and it's gonna basically cycle us through all the options that we've got here. Saved podcasts, three episodes, two. Using the access downloader to obtain a daisy book with David Woodbridge, part one, 131,205, a lot of MP3. information there. But this is a, a saved podcast where I've, I've been on into my podcast. I've saved it. I've wanted to take it and keep it. And what it does, it stores it in this part of the bookshelf. So very handy. And because it's an MP3, you can actually come in here and copy it and, and send it off to a friend or share it with somebody else. So I'm going to press the one again. Text files. Eight. Files. Five. Terrific. This one is the text files. So these are documents that have that I've copied in here. This this is Tyrific, the book called Tyrific. But I've got a number of other. Uh, well, I've got eight files in here. It gives you that information. And if I wanted to, I could just go down and push the confirm key or the hash key in this case, and it'll take me into that folder. Now I'm going to push one again because I'm still cycling my way through the bookshelf. Notes 25. Notes 42. Okay, it says notes. Now these are the audio notes that you can record using the Victor Reader. Very powerful part of the, of the Victor Reader. But it said 25, but it said there were 42 notes there. That's because it gives each of them a number and then by deleting them, uh, you remove them. So there's 25 actual notes on there, but I've actually taken 42 notes in, in total. So I'm gonna press the number one again. Talking books, two. Books, two. Swimming with Crocodiles, by Will Chaffee. Narrated by Francis Greenslade. Okay, now these are uh, talking books. This is a particular part where you put daisy formatted books. They are the only ones here at the moment. I think I'll, if I press it again. Other books, back one. to Charlie, book, I think. One. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Yes, factor. there he is, all right. Now, when you get your Victor Reader, that often the only thing that will appear on your Victor Reader will be the notes. Because what happens is that unless you actually have a material or content in that folder, it won't show up on this menu. So the way to actually put the content on or into your uh, Victor Reader is to put it on your SD card or copy it in from an external source. But it won't show up on your bookshelf initially at this point until you've got content in there. So that's how you can navigate around the bookshelf. There's a similar bookshelf on the wireless side. And if I go up and push the little round button in the middle, which is the Wi-Fi key. Airplane mode on okay. bookshelf podcasts okay. three podcast feeds two. the blind sport podcast Mike Lloyd. So Four what we've what we've episodes. what we've done here we've switched from the bookshelf where we we 
uh, store our text files and our talking books and things like that that we uh, we can load from the SD card they are on on one side and now we've gone over to the Wi-Fi side and this is where all the material that comes in through Wi-Fi will come down into this area so it will have some things like it's got podcasts which we just heard and let's go through and have a look at some of these because I think some of these options people might be very interested in Bookshare Two. Books. One. Empty Pleasures. The story of artificial sweetness from saccharin to splendor. Bookshare is a library service that I subscribe to from America. Um, and I have to do that through um, a library service here in Australia. And that means that I can access all of their, their downloadable uh, library services. Fantastic. They are really a really great service. Um, but so that appears in there as one of uh, was one of my options. If I press the one again, Internet Radio four playlists four SVRC underscore Internet underscore Radio underscore three. Okay, so what this is? This is Internet Radio, and this is where you can go and listen to. I think you've only got about thirty thousand radio stations to choose from, so that gives you gives you plenty of scope. Plus, the other thing is you can actually record now using the notes feature. You can actually record the things that you're listening to on the radio, which is very handy. So I'm going to press the one again, still using the bookshelf key. References one file one Wikipedia wikisaccharinen.html. Uh, this gives you access to Wikipedia. One more. Podcasts. Back to Three. podcasts. Podcast feeds. Okay. Two. The Blind Sport Podcast. Mike Lloyd. Okay. Four. New episodes. There's any amount of podcast feeds as well. So if I want to jump back from here to my book, other bookshelf, I just go back up, press the round key in the top middle, which is the Wi-Fi key, and it takes us back to the other side. Bookshelf. Other books. One. Book. One. Back to Charlie. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. There he goes. So it's as easy as that switching between the two, the two areas. Just by pressing the Wi-Fi key, you go between the two. Material will only be shown in those bookshelves if there is material in that folder. Remember, it, you will have access to music there, but it won't normally show up until you've actually put music content in there. And at all times, you use the number one key to actually navigate your way through the different options within the bookshelf. So very simplistic, very easy. Just remember one. For more videos in this series, please check out the SVRC website, svrc.vic.edu.au.